Welcome back guys to another Hogwarts Legacy Let's Play gameplay. Hopefully you are all enjoying and um, I am enjoying this series a lot. I have fun with it quite a bit. Um, we don't just do quests here. We, we do we do do other stuff. We do mess around and we, we are going to mess around in this video. We are going to do some side missions. We have got a lot of side missions. There are so many side missions to do. I do want to get through the main story as fast as possible. Well, not as fast as possible because I do want to search around. In the last episode, if you did miss it, go and watch it. It's fantastic. But in the last episode, we did go and uh, see Sebastian Sallow's sister and all that good stuff. That was very, very fun. I did enjoy it. We learned some of the history of um, Sebastian. And uh, yeah, if I would recommend going to watch that if you haven't already. The link is in the description down below. Also, do not forget to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. It is greatly appreciated and really does help out. So yeah, drop a like on the video and uh, hit that subscribe button if you're new around here. And uh, I, I appreciate all of you guys that have been watching the previous parts. It really does help out. The mechanics with the the the, uh, the capes are very very weird. Just lately, they're being very very strange. I know they are they are updating the game as we play. Meet me near the ruins of Falbarton Castle after dark. Do not tell anyone. Okay, so we got another quest from uh, Natty. Uh, I don't think we spoke to her in a while. So we've got over here astronomy class. I don't know what we get from it. But it seems to be the only main mission we've actually got. We've actually got here. For some reason. I don't I'm not too sure why. We've got this the pulso puzzle room. A secret deposit training room in Hogwarts collection chest. We could quickly do that actually. I want to see what that is. These the Pulso puzzle rooms are very, very... It'd be a good way to open up the video, so... We are going to be doing another main mission in this one, though. Where the frick are you, dude? Are you inside? It might be inside, actually. That we have to go inside. We do. So let's just... Let's, let's go here. I think it's indoors. I could honestly be wrong, but there's so many secrets to Hogwarts. It's unreal. Like there's so many secrets. Let's just see what we can do. Uh, I've got oh, this. Has one person even tried to sort this? Are we going down. Oh my god! I don't even know where, where it's taking us right now. I'm just following it, guys. Literally just following it. I have a bloody clue where it wants me to go, but we're going to follow it nonetheless. Hello, Amora. Hello, Amora. Here we go. Oh. Oh. Come on. There we go. Mate, they're, they're, they're tough, you know. But they are so hard to get the hang on. Oh, and sorry if you hear my phone, guys. Good finger. Can I not like this? Well, what's the point in you? Revelio. Revelio, baby. Oh, here's another page. Hello, Mate, we can we we we're just we're just discovering secrets. There we go. We are just discovering secrets, guys. I'm getting better at these locks, by the way. Rebellion. Right, what have we got here? Yes. Okay, so it's just wiggle well potions. That's it.
Well, we're, we're max on Wiggle Wild Potions, to be honest, so we don't really need it all that much, but... Oh, there's a book. Akio. Can I do Wingardium? Wingardium Leviosa. Oh, I really have to put it on? Come on, man. Leviosa. There's another page. I swear we've nearly done all the pages. Depulsa. I ain't a fan of these rooms, boys. I ain't a fan of these rooms. Like, I don't mind secrets, but oh my god, some of these puzzles are difficult. Mate, what are these puzzles? You gotta be joking me, where do I have to go? Place it there. So I need this one. Right, can you go there? Um. I have to go over there. If I'm being honest, guys, I have no clue what I've got to do. Like, zero clue what I have to do. Um, no, I might do these. I might not do these now. Just because they're going to take a while and I don't want to... I don't want to not do them. I might do them off camera. I don't know. Let me know in the comment section whether you guys want me to see me do them. Because that could be funny. Because me and puzzles, we don't... I'm not very good at them. Rebellion. But I will end up doing... I will end up doing puzzles. Is there a... Uh... What's in here? History of magic. I was looking for a there's a, there's a butterfly here. And I was looking for a s painting. To be honest. Is that in that room? Have I missed chests? How could I be so stupid? Revelio. It's not, it's not even in the room. What the hell? There's no painting here either. Why is there a butterfly there when there's no painting? Well, okay. Looks like it's getting... Oh, is that for that? Okay, I'm going back to get a butterfly. Give me a butterfly. I think you're for this one over here. Uh, Lumos. Come on. Come with me. We're going to put you in your frame. Which I think is this one over here. Oh, do it you is, know? yes. My there you go. Hey, this game has so much freaking repair value. A lot of you guys said uh, you wanted me to stream it. Now, if I did stream it, guys, it would only be... What's this? In the shadows, in the shadow of bloodline, speak to Sebastian. Oh, we're gonna do it. We got no choice, guys. We have to do it. I want to be able to do the uh, three unforgivable unfor curses, and these are the missions to do them. I've already said that travel broadens the. So mind. that's what we're gonna do. Anything to do with the dark heart should be avoided. It's too risky. Anything to do with Salazar Slytherin is worth the risk. I can't agree. And I'll not say a word more. I'm sorry. Okay. I won't give up. Talk to Sebastian, okay. What were you and Omina speaking about? He's being ridiculous. Apparently Salazar Slytherin had a secret scriptorium here in Hogwarts. 
Omina swears it was used for the dark arts, so he wants nothing to do with it. I reminded him that Anne needs a cure. This scriptorium could hold the answers we need. The dark arts do pique my interest. There's more to dark magic than people realize. The Gaunts know this better than most. Perhaps I've spoken out of turn. Ominous's family history is personal to him. I'd like to know more about it, if you wouldn't mind telling me. I won't repeat it. Very well. But do keep this between us. Ominous learned dark magic from his parents. Are you familiar with the Cruciatus Curse? Crucio, correct? The Cruciatus Curse, also known as the Torture Curse, inflicts excruciating pain on the victim. Apparently, his parents and older siblings had no qualms about casting it on muggles for sport. Ominous described the sound of the I victim's cries as horrific. To be able to, so the first uh... time he was asked to cast it himself as a child, he couldn't bring himself to do it. Okay. As punishment, his family cast it on him. The anguish was so bad that when asked to cast it again, he relented. I have repeatedly assured Ominous that he did what he had to, but he still hasn't forgiven himself. Oh, okay. Uh, he had no choice. How horrible. Poor Ominous. He was only a child. He shouldn't blame himself. After that incident, the rift between Ominous and his family only grew. That is until I came along. Every moment he isn't at Hogwarts, he's with us in Feldcroft. Ominous trusts me. And more often than not, he winds up listening to me. I'll remind him of that when I follow up about the scriptorium. Watch for my owl. I'll have news soon enough. I'll make Ominous understand. Okay. He'll change his mind. I do want to do uh, Sebastian's storyline just because you get the, um, the Crucio, the Avada, the Kadabra. And the, uh, the, the three unthinkable curses, you get them with his storyline. So... It will be good to be able to get them all. There is something here, but I don't know what it is. They've got a black flag there. But I don't have a clue what it is. Um, there's also... Some side missions we can do here. I might do some of these side missions off camera as well, guys. Um, just because... Otherwise it's going to take a while. Because there's so many, it's ridiculous. I also do a part of if you hear people in the background. It's just my kids and my fiance. There's another one up here we gotta do. Let's go to uh, meet Natty. Let's meet Natty. Look at the quest real quick. The high keep astronomy class. We could go do astronomy class. Yeah, since we're in there, we'll we'll, we'll go we'll do astronomy astronomy class. Let me just let me just fast travel to it. Well, I'll fast travel as close as we can get. <laughs> I actually don't remember if we've done this class yet. There's a chest here, but I don't know how you get it. Let me go. Rebellion. Oh, it's up there. Must be a lock. All right, let's go to a astronomy, astronomy class. Astronomy. I can't say the bloody bloody name of the class. Alright. Alright. Run all the way up. Here we go. Uh, why do we have to take astronomy? It's not even magic. And your reading is the dragon. That's exciting, I suppose. Perhaps you're due for an adventure. Oh.
Ladies, Professor Shah, astronomy is not divination. You won't find the mysteries of the cosmos charted out on your palms or at the bottom of your teacups. Alas, the heavens remain hazy to the starry-eyed. Now, if you were to devote yourselves to persistent and painstaking observation, you just might catch a glimpse. With that in mind, please take your telescopes. Tonight we will be on the observation deck. Okay. That's pretty. Still don't have your own? You can't be the new student forever, you know. You can share with Mr. Takar. Oh. Here, I can adjust that for no, you. No, no. Bring it into focus on your own. Focus. There we go. Now, I expect all of you to put in your stargazing hours outside of class. Is that clear? But, Professor, it's freezing out. Mere cold didn't stop the great stargazers of the past. Look only to the astronomy tables they erected throughout the highlands from which they gazed millennia ago on the very selfsame stars above us. Is that clear? <sighs> Dismissed. Oh, she loves stars, bro. Hello. I don't believe we've met officially. I'm Amit. I'm something of an astronomy buff. Hello, Amit. It's nice to meet you. Did I hear Professor Shaw say that you don't have your own telescope? I have a spare one you could borrow for the rest of term. Thank you. How kind. That's very kind of you, Amit. Are you sure you won't need it? I'm certain. It's my old one. I finally got my hands on the new Celestia Contemplor. You've heard of it, I assume? I mean, of course you have. It's only the pinnacle of all personal stargazing implements. But my old model's not too shabby either. Goblin cut glass, first rate optical enchantments. Hate to think such a fine instrument is just collecting dust. Well, I, I thank you, Amit. Think nothing of it. Anyway, the telescope's in the storage room right underneath us. You can't miss it. I have some, uh, reading to finish on the lower deck. Come find me there afterwards and bring the telescope. There's something I want to talk to you about. Okay. I tried to put off my stargazing as long as I could. So, what do I need? The telescope. How am I supposed to find Sirius when my find hands are too cold to the telescope? It's a dog, isn't it? Oh, I need to go down, back downstairs. It's telling me to go upstairs. What the hell is this game right now? Am I losing my marbles? It's just there. How do I get there? Or do I go down here? No. Nope. Ah, down here. <laughs> I'm an absolute fool. Open. This was his old telescope. <laughs> That's practically brand new. And we got one of these as well. Mate, we, we got to be nearly finished the, the, the books at this point, the pages. Surely. <sighs> A pristine night for stargazing. Not really. Stargazing. The perfect night for... I have the telescope. It's nicer than I'd expected. I would not offer a prospective stargazer a third-rate lunoscope. <laughs> but there is, um, something else. Yes, what is it? You remember those astronomy tables Shaw was going on about? It just so happens I've been reading up on them a little myself. And it seems there may be one right here at Hogwarts. I believe we could use it to find hidden constellations. And you'd like help finding it. And you need someone to help find it. I do. Are you in? No one from the Gobstones Club will go with me. Said they'd rather get spit at by a stone than... Well, they are cowards. 
Let us get moving while the stars are still out. I'll show you how to use that telescope once we get there. I promise. Uh, I suppose I could join you. Sounds exciting. I'm in. All right. I suppose I can go with you. I hope it's worth it. It will be. Trust me. I have read practically everything there is to read about this. It should be brilliant. Shall we? Okay. Looks like this is our mission, boys. Okay. We're outside. The table is on a castle wall ahead. Look for a stone platform. Something that doesn't quite belong. We'll know it when we see it. Onwards we go. Some say the locations of the tables were originally marked by centaurs for ritual stargazing. Huh. It is nice having a fellow stargazer to explore with. Well, Happy to be here. It is good to leave the classroom now and then. Not for me. It's not that creepy out here at night, is it? No, I'm not just. The Gobstones Club are cowards. Here I am, charging ahead. Uh, why don't you lead the way? If you're sure. Why am I going? Hmm. A little four point. A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. Oh, Rebellion. It's just not as tidy as I do. Just making sure I collect everything. More cobwebs. You don't think any spiders might be lurking about? Oh no. Not this close to school, I mean. Look, there's a table. I think you should do the honors. Did you? Go on, try it out. Use. The constellation should appear near the center of your view. Okay. Do I have to match it up or something? As soon as you've lined up the telescope, we will be able to fill out our star chart. I don't even know how you line this up. How do you line this up? Must be stargazing is all about patience and precision. I am so confused. Ah, where there? There we go. Mate, that's weird. I was right about the tables. They really are gateways to the far stars, just as the book said. And your contribution was invaluable. Rest assured, you shall be credited in my memoirs one day. Thank you, Amit. I look forward to reading them. And I look forward to writing them. <laughs> this is only the beginning. You will find more tables like this one throughout the grounds and forest, all beckoning to be discovered by a worthy astronomer. And if I have ever seen one, it's you. Oh, and about my old telescope. Don't bother returning it. You should keep it. Oh. That's quite generous. Thank you. You are welcome. It has goblin cut glass and a gobbledygook inscription. I'm practically fluent in gobbledygook, you know. It's all in the throat, really, gobbledygook, you know, and, and how you pronounce your R's. Ahem. Anyway, <clears> glad <throat> our adventure was a success. I will see you soon. My phone keeps going. I do apologize. Uh, astronomy class. Done. Okay. Let's have a look at some of these other quests. We've got, obviously we've got Natty's quest. Which we will do, but... Um, I do want to... What gears we are? Might have to sell some of this stuff. I don't want to. 
across this one. Oh, I like that. Let's equip that. Um, hmm. We ain't got no no post from Sebastian yet. So obviously we've got the mermaids, uh, brother's keeper, the one we can't do with the spider yet. So we're not level thirty. Hmm. Let's go and see if we can find some more quests real fast. <sighs> Never do get tired. What was that anyway? What we just saw. Oh, find night. astronomy tables. What a view. Okay. All right. That's not going to be our main focus at the minute. I would like to do some... All the questions go off the map or something. What the hell? There's these two here. Let's go to Hogsmeade. There might be some quests in Hogsmeade. And we can also sell some stuff. One here. Let's see what this guy wants. I want to help as many people as possible, so... Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Alright. Oh, my dear business. Oh, it's a goblin. Hello? Is something the matter? Most decidedly, yes. My precious moon calf biscuit was abducted by poachers up north. All oh, the vicious brutes. I tried to fight back, but I was no match for them. Oh. I'm sorry about your moon calf, Mr... Garnuff. Just Garnuff. I'm only one goblin. Not a particularly brave one at that. I have no chance against a pack of bloodthirsty poachers. Oh, my poor biscuit. I can only hope she's able to escape. Uh, okay. Let's I'll go and get her. out for your moon calf, Garnet. Oh, how kind. If only all of wizard kind was as gracious to goblins. If you do see her and can bring her safely home to me, I promise to reward you for your efforts. We're going to go and get his goblin, guys. Do keep an eye out for her. And be careful out there. Poachers are an unscrupulous lot. Yeah. I should try and rescue Garnet's moon calf. Sounds as if I'd need to head north to find those poachers. I can't get in anywhere. Still. I need to get level 2 Hello Amora. Alright. But for now, can I get in here? No. Level 3 locked. Love it. We've got to go all the way up north. I can't fly yet. As soon as I can... Actually, what I am going to do is I'm going to turn it to daytime. We're gonna go and do this during the day. You don't ever want to find yourself in the pocket of one who knows the cruciatus curse. Yeah. My advice when dealing with underwater metals is. Alright. Hogsmeade, here I come. Oh no, we're leaving Hogsmeade, mate. Can I get in here? No, level three. Wonder if I can use my broom yet. Yes, I can. We are just going to go and get his goblin back for uh, his moon calf back for him. Some of these blooms. Poachers. God, if it was right then, I'd better be careful. Um. Revelio. Oh, you want to leave it at least a week before you go poking about the tracks of a strailer? Need to let his trail stop smouldering. But then you can find some good treasures. Yes, you can. I sold some baby nipplers the other day, fetched a small fortune. You always get more when they're small. 
Oh my god, there's so many of them. So many poachers, it's unreal. He hasn't spotted me, he hasn't spotted me. Hmm. I want to mess you all up. This guy's just standing still, so I'm going to quickly go and get him. Last one. Okay. Let's get his uh Aloha Mora. There we go. Which one of you is Biscuit? Which one's Biscuit? How the hell are you meant to know? Revelio. How the hell are you meant to know which one's Biscuit? The chest here, though. I'm guessing I'm going to have to uh, capture Biscuit. Revelio. How the hell are you meant to know which one's Biscuit? to find his bloody calf. Revelio. How the hell are you meant to find it? I don't understand. No, if that was this <laughs> Revelio. Do I have to just capture all of them? Like seriously? Huh? 
Revelio. Might have no clue which one. I might have to search this up. I don't have a clue which one Biscuit is. How the hell are you meant to know? Why couldn't there just be one one poacher? Or one moon calf? Why'd they have to make everything so difficult? Maybe I'll just have to collect them all. I'm just going to collect every moon calf I see or something. Let me also. Oh my god. That biscuit? Professor Howen will never believe this. That was a biscuit, Eva? I'll release the ones that you know home. I'll, I'll release the ones that ain't biscuits, so don't worry, guys. Revelio, <coughs> mate. Okay, where is this? Where's this biscuit moon calf, man? Do my head in. Revelio. It'd help if they actually sh show up on the map so you can s see. Get up, man. It's a little rock. Levioso. Are you Biscuit? Is any of them Biscuit? There, there. I'm not going to hurt you. Mate, I'm so, conf I'm so confused. I've been here for ages, bro. Ah, that biscuit? That This one has to be biscuit. Surely to God. Be biscuit! Everything's alright now. Revelio. It says rescue biscuit, but I, I, I honestly have no clue. I'm re I've rescued tons of them. What more can I do? Revelio. I'll just keep searching over here, I guess. But all the way around. I have no clue which one's Biscuit. Revelio. It doesn't really help you out that much. This this challenge is a bit of a bullshit challenge. Because it doesn't help you out at all. Professor Howard will never 
believe this. Yeah, so you keep saying. That's still apparently not biscuit. I mean, how many more is there? I'm searched this whole freaking place. There's got to be. The biscuit's got to be here. There's no place it can Rebellion. be. I mean, how the hell are you meant to know? Honestly, don't know how you're meant to know, and I'm actually leaving the purple area now. So, rebellion. Hmm. I might have to come back to this one. I honestly don't know if I've got biscuit or I haven't. They need to make this very easier to understand. Defender. Did not break anything. Defender. Revelio. Where the hell's Bish here? Maybe I've already got him. Do I already have him? Oh, I'm very confused. I found Biscuit in a large pen covering other moon calves. The poachers have captured. Just need to unlock the gate and rescue her. Oh my god. What is this game? This has to be moon... This has to be Biscuit. I, ha I have... Revelio. Oh my god. It should tell you which one's Biscuit. So you can know. Oh, it doesn't help you at all. That's a stupid frog. Ah, oh, this doesn't help you at all. I don't honestly don't know if I can actually do this because I can't. I don't know where biscuit is. I'm actually gonna search it up real quick because. So, I need to see what it looks like. I honestly don't know. It does not tell you anything. Do I have biscuit or not? Uh, I think I'm done with this one, guys. Honestly. <laughs> I don't know where Biscuit is. If she's not, if I haven't caught her already, I've caught so many of the moon calves that are in the pen. One of them has to be Biscuit. I tell you what, we'll just go. Let me go to quests. Take the biscuit. I've already done that. I've rescued. Oh my god, this freaking game! It doesn't tell you.
It doesn't tell you if you've got it or not. This has to be some sort of bug. Oh, shut up. Mate, I will never, ever, 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 ever get another moon calf. These things are so annoying. Just let me catch you for frick's sake. I'm going to fly around quick. And then we're going to go. Whether I find it or not. I don't care about your stupid little biscuit. I honestly couldn't give a flying monkey's ass anymore. It's, it's pissing me off. Tells you to search the area. Rebellion. Which I'm doing. But surely you should come on the map. I've searched this whole area like five times and I can't find biscuit. I must have already captured it. I must have. Where's the other moon calf go? There was one more moon calf around here. Now I can't find it. Is it daytime? I'm gonna I'm gonna wait here. Oh my god! Why can't you do anything when you're on your broom? It's actually ridiculous. You can't do nothing when you're on your broom. I know moon casts only come out at night. Ah, oh, trying to find bloody biscuit, bro. It's so difficult. Revelio. Yeah. Oh, where's this stupid moon calf? Oh, wait a Do I actually... What's this? Oh. Rebellion. Mate, I hate moon calves. Like, I am not in the mood for this shit. Just come out, man. If you're hiding somewhere, just come out. I literally, how, 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 long, how long do I have to look now? This is ridiculous. This mission's broken. It must be. Because I have no clue what this Rebellion. stupid freaking moon calf is. Oh, piss off, frog. I think I am done, guys. I think I'm done looking for it. I ain't. His biscuit can F off for all I care. I really don't give a shit anymore. I'm done with his stupid ass biscuit. Rebellion. I'll have one more look over here. And then I'm done. Can't keep looking for it, I'm afraid. It's a shame I wanted to get this done, but it's not gonna let me, so but he could be run anywhere and I wouldn't know. Ah Levioso. If this is you, I swear to God, Biscuit. Oh, you take the fucking piss, the Biscuit! Oh my god, I'm giving you straight back to that moron. 
Oh my god, that biscuit takes that effing piss, bruh. Like, it's awful. Awful biscuit. Never do that quest, guys. Ever. And you just saw how long that took me. That quest was bloody horrible. Oh, F off. Goblins everywhere. Abandoned long ago, no doubt. No doubt, no doubt. I hate Biscuit. I hate him. With a passion. Me and Biscuit, we're going to have fights. I'll tell you that right now. Does it get any more cosy than Hogsmeade? Yeah, it does. Everywhere else. It's where we met this stupid guy that wants Biscuit. I, I could have just fast travelled. I don't know why I haven't just fast travelled. Me and Biscuit, we're going to have words, right? We're going to have so many words because that Biscuit's so annoying. Take your stupid Biscuit back. What will I do without her? Garnef, I've rescued Biscuit. You have? Oh, is she hurt? Was she frightened? Are you all right? It was terrifying for both of us. If it weren't for me, I suspect those poachers would have flayed her alive. Oh, perish the thought. Thank Merlin you were able to save her in time. I cannot wait to get her home. Oh, I so miss seeing her dance in the evenings. Such joy. Uh, I'm sure she'll be glad to be home. I'm glad she's safe now. I'm sure she'll be happy to go home. Oh, that is a great weight off my mind. Oh, my sweet little biscuit. My wise, noble moon calf. And here is your reward, of course. Well deserved. As I said before, you have restored my faith in wizard kind. You've damaged my... You've restored at least You've damaged my faith my in faith finding in moon calves. Biscuit and I can't thank you enough. Can't stand that biscuit, bro. Revelio. The most annoying moon calf on the planet. Uh, I'm gonna go and sell some stuff. Hello there. In the market for potions, are we? <sighs> I never want to see another moon car for as long as I live. <laughs> that was effing annoying, man. What do you got for me? Anything and you go, oh you sell tongues and troll bogies. Okay. I don't care for I hope to see you again. Very oh well I fucking hate him. Hate him so much. Hates them. Right. Because that took so bloody long, we're gonna do this side mission as well for you guys. Uh. This must be the cellar. How to find that venomous tentacular? Better not let Mr. Lawley see me. What is this garbage? Where is that venomous tentacular? There's a chest over there as well. Oh, you got to be joking me. What could be stupid? Stop! Stop, bandit! I got caught. Ah, you stupid ass. Why would you come here? Just tell me why you would come where I am. 
absolute knob. Oh, what the hell? Where is that venomous tentacular? Can't I just freaking kill him? Oh, trick the chest. I'll just come in here again at some other point. I literally can't be bothered. There it is. Revelio. Oh, you gotta be joking me. Expelliarmus, Confringo. Defendo. Wonder they haven't taken over the whole world. Predator, stupefy. Can I get out of here, please? more of you out there. Expelliarmus. Confringo. Just die, bro. Revelio. Freaking hate spiders, man. I hate you all. I'm gonna collect everything I can get here. Um, I do apologize if you hear people in the background. Just my kids. Now that I have the venomous tentacular, I should return to Mr. Barnes. Can I not just? Can I not pull up my map? Hello. Are you map not available? I wanted a fast travel. Looks like I've got a sneak by this moron again. Fancy having massive spiders in your basement. Oh, you're still there. Alright. Can I get out of here? Do I have to? Can I not just walk up? Mate, this episode has been a bloody disaster. Alright. Any luck retrieving a certain friend of... Hello, Mr. Barnes. I have that venomous tentacular. <laughs> Wish I could see Lawley's face when he realizes his prized possession is gone. Mm. We'll see who's volatile now. Well done. I'll take it off your hands now. Uh, I'd like to be paid. It wasn't as easy to come by as I had expected. I had expected. to fight spiders, bro. I'd like to be paid for my troubles. <sighs> Only fair, I suppose. I can respect your business acumen. Yeah. Here's a little something for your next trip to Zonko's. How much should you give me? Thank you again for your help. I suspect you have a bright future. 500, not too bad. Not too shabby. Alright guys, I think I'm going to call the episode there. Most of this stupid episode was just looking for that stupid biscuit. And I do apologise about that. But uh, when you can't find biscuit, I do apologise. <laughs> there were so many moon casts, man. And it just made me go crazy. Uh, but yeah. I love you guys. Thank you for supporting the videos and all that good stuff. And I shall see you all on the next video. Peace out, guys.